One that, that any student of the game who's watched MMA for a long, long time is familiar with is the old fight where Hoist Gracie fought Akebono. It was like a 500 pound sumo wrestler. Hoist, as yeah. you guys know, is like buck 85, buck 75, kind of longer, skinnier guy. Akebono's like giant sumo world champion, like 500 pounds of legit man. Scary, scary times. He might be more like 600, like, I don't know, the scariest dude ever. But uh, he basically tackled Hoist, and Hoist hit him with a really cool omoplata into a wrist lock. So omoplata itself can be a complicated move. We're going to kind of simplify it a little bit and show how that wrist lock transition happens. So I'll borrow Jesse for this one. So we're going to start off in the closed guard, where Jesse, let's say Jesse took me down, I end up on my back. This is what happened. Aki Boner just kind of ran at Hoist with his big sumo muscles and and whatever else sumo, muscle, sumo wrestlers are made of, just no muscle, right? And uh, flattened him out. And Hoist was stuck here on his back. And uh, he's, against, he's got this giant guy on top of him. He probably couldn't breathe. So he bumped off to the side. Watch what I'm going to do here. I'm going to bump my hips off to the side like this. So his arm is rest, his elbow is resting on my hip already. I bump my hip off, off to the side. This foot, this left foot, those of you guys who can't see, this foot here is on Jesse's opposite hip. So I'm stepping on his hip. You guys got to move around. That's fine. I move around all the time when I'm watching techniques, so I'm here. Now, this leg of mine is going to come over his shoulder, it's going to round his shoulder and come in front of his head. Now, I can turn this into a shoulder lock, I can turn this into all kinds of crazy transitions, but this guy was so huge, Hoist probably couldn't even get it any farther than this because there was so much man to move. So instead of trying to attack the shoulder, he did the smart thing against someone who's 500 pounds and went right after the small joint here, went right after the wrist. So I'm going to go back to Jesse's wrist here. So after this leg has come off over the top, boom, now I've gotten his weight off of me. Now I can finally breathe because I've knocked him off using his shoulder here. I get this wrist, I'm going to fold his palm towards his elbow. And I can cup with both hands if I want to. And again, try to get these fingers and this palm right down to his own forearm here. Folding, get my submission. So attacking the small joint here. Really nice and easy. This should be a, a pretty gentle technique for an easy tap. I'm here, I'm in position, I'm getting held down. I'm going to bump off to the side, this foot goes into the hip, and I swing this leg over. So I end up in position right underneath his neck with this leg. Now if he tries to get his weight back into me, go ahead. Even if he's big, I can kind of kick him away. Because I've got my whole lower body here to be able to boot him. So it's just me and his arm now, hanging out. Hit that wrist, fold that palm of his down towards his own elbow, and force my submission. So really, really fundamental transition into the omoplata, and then that fold over for the wrist lock. This is really the mechanism we're using. If I can use both hands to cut behind it, it's going to make it a lot stronger if I just try to push with one. I cup with both and I fold to get that sub, okay? So you guys should feel a nice easy tap there on the wrist. We're going to go through this transition, famous Hoist Gracie versus Akebo. Hey there, do you want to learn all of these UFC techniques in a free DVD sent to you? We literally have the entire seminar on DVD, and we will send this DVD to you free, shipped, and we're sending them all over the state of Rhode Island, uh, simply by visiting blackdiamondmma.com slash UFC and filling in the form there, or by giving us a call at 401-308-3229. In addition, you'll also get a copy of my book, The Unexpected Champion, featuring Ben Askren, who's an undefeated pro MMA fighter and a wrestling Olympian. So you'll have all these UFC uh, techniques via DVD from the entire seminar that we did, UFC Techniques Made Easy. Um, and you'll also get a copy of the Ben Askren book sent to you 100% for free. Again, either give us a call at the number there or visit blackdiamondmma.com slash UFC.